it's more important than ever to have one of the best camera phones these days. As for many of us, our smartphone is the only camera we own. It's certainly the camera that's closest at hand when you see an unforgettable image you want to capture. So you'll definitely want a phone with a camera setup that can deliver the shot you desire. That's why in today's video, we are going to talk about the top 5 best camera phones that you can have to enhance your on-the-move photography skill. So without further ado, let's get started. If you're looking for a fuss-free and capable point-and-shoot camera phone, then the Google Pixel 5 might be the handset for you. While the Google Pixel 5 might not have the most up-to-date tech, what it lacks in innovation, it makes up for with reliability and usability. The rear dual camera unit on the Google Pixel 5 features a 12.2 megapixel 27mm f1.7 camera and a 16 megapixel ultra-wide f2.2 camera. But it's the software that really elevates this camera to excellence. Meanwhile, the Snapdragon 765G chipset works well with the Android 11 OS for a lag-free camera phone experience. The Google Pixel 5 also has some exciting flagship features to offer, such as a 90Hz refresh rate display, water resistance, and wireless charging. OnePlus smartphones have always struggled to keep up with other top-end Android phones in the camera department. But the OnePlus 9 Pro has the best camera we have seen on a handset from the company. OnePlus has stepped up its game here by including new sensors with at least one of them made in combination with Sony and by teaming up with famed camera maker Hasselblad to improve color calibration so that the colors you see are reproduced as accurately as possible. The main camera has a 48 megapixel rear shooter and it uses a Sony IMX789 sensor that was made in collaboration with Sony. There are three other cameras on the rear, including a 50 megapixel ultra wide camera that uses a Sony IMX766 sensor. There's also an 8 megapixel telephoto shooter that can shoot at up to three times optical zoom while the final element is a 2-megapixel monochrome shooter that essentially allows you to get higher quality black and white imagery. On the front of the phone is a selfie shooter with a 16-megapixel IMX741 sensor and an aperture of f by 2.4, which is not the most high-end, but good. The iPhone 12 Pro Max is the best camera phone you can buy, which is saying something given how strong the competition is. The 12 Pro Max stands out compared to other iPhone 12 models with its main wide camera. The larger sensor lets it more light. It also includes a sensor shift image stabilization system that results in a super steady video shot in Dolby Vision HDR. The main camera on the iPhone 12 Pro Max is joined by an ultra-wide lens with a 120-degree field of view and a 65mm telephoto camera with a 2.5x optical zoom and 12x digital zoom. Apple's computational photography capabilities are very impressive, which includes an improved deep fusion system for exquisite details and smart HDR3 that delivers well-balanced photos in challenging lighting conditions. Plus, with the LiDAR sensor built in, you can take portraits even in night mode. The iPhone 12 Pro Max can even record photos in Pro Raw mode to give photographers the ultimate flexibility in terms of editing. You might be surprised to see the Huawei Mate 40 Pro here as it has got some software limits but none of them have to do with its cameras. In fact, its cameras are exceptional. It has a 50 megapixel f1.9 main camera, a 12 megapixel f3.4 periscope, one with a 5 times optical zoom, and a 20 megapixel f1.8 ultra wide one. While that's not quite as many lenses as some rivals, it's got all the most important cams accounted for, and they all perform very well. From portrait shots to wide landscapes, zoom photos, and close up subjects, the Huawei Mate 40 Pro 
could cope brilliantly with just about every kind of photo. It even does a great job in low-light conditions. And while our focus is the rear snapper, the Huawei Mate 40 Pro also has a decent setup on the front. With a 13 megapixel f2.4 camera joined by a time of flight sensor for sensing depth. There are lots of photography modes and tools available on the Huawei Mate 40 Pro as well, from a light painting feature to a dedicated moon photography mode. The latest Galaxy S21 Ultra does have everything it can to solidify Samsung's space as the camera phone to get when you want to zoom in for finer details. Samsung has equipped the Galaxy S21 Ultra with a pair of telephoto lenses, one with 3x optical zoom, while the other with a 10 times, and the results were impressive. Support for 100 times digital zoom returns too, and now there's a zoom lock feature to help you keep these shots in focus. A laser focus sensor also complements the main 108 megapixel lens. The Galaxy S21 Ultra features a number of new software tricks that help you get more creative with your photos. The simple take feature from last year has been improved to now generate slow motion videos when you press the shutter button. Director's view lets you capture video from both the front and rear camera simultaneously, and you can also switch between the S21's different lenses on the fly. The Galaxy S21 Ultra's ability to record 8K videos makes it a great device to have if you capture a lot of videos and these zoom lenses put the iPhone unnoticed. This is a great camera phone to have if you're an Android fan. So that was our list of the best camera phones of 2021 for you. Thanks for watching our video. Like, comment, and share with your friends if you find this video helpful. Subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.